In this crypto world of these people that are trading, they're traders, they're trading this coin. They're just trading art. You know, they've got their investment cake. It's another slice of the cake. Well, take mine, take my slice. It tastes much nicer. <laughs> As far as I know, I am the first artist to really embrace Bitcoin, start actually producing works that evolve around cryptocurrency. When I'm sketching out those pieces, it's got a very, um, it's a very sinewy type, aggressive nature in the figurative works. And I think that um, that's looking at us pushing out. So pushing out for what we want. Let's have a look at these people that invested in Bitcoin. You know, they're, they're, they're risk taking people, they're optimistic, they're pushing out there, they're looking. And that is a very, it's a very unusual type of person. Even if there is a gamble involved in this, which I have no doubt there is, that is the sort of person I'm interested in. So when I'm sketching out those figures, I'm thinking of that, uh, you know, whether I win or whether I lose, I'm gonna go for it. So I do a preparation on my sale. So for instance, I'll send them uh, an image of what I'm working on, whether it's social media. So I use Facebook, I use Instagram, I use Twitter, I use WhatsApp so I can send news very quickly to a collector that might be interested. But this is instantaneous sometimes. I mean, this is like within three or four minutes, I'm getting someone saying, yeah, I'll take it. And this is real. You know, it's, it's not like I've got to create the art, phone up the art agent, position it in the gallery, stick it on the wall, lose 50%. This is over. This is over. If I go down the line of cryptocurrency, the chance of me losing 50% with that coin fluctuating is a lot less. I haven't been exchanging any of my cryptocurrency for fiat currency at all. And that's been for the last two months because I'm very, very sure it's just going to rise in value. And here we have Bitcoin boy. So all this talk about maybe Bitcoin sliding. Hmm, don't think so somehow. The cryptocurrency, you know, it's not a fiat currency, okay? So it's not basically governed. I'm not basically governed. So there is a, there is a, a synergy uh, between myself and I think and many contemporary artists because contemporary artists have got to think outside the box. And I think that with cryptocurrency and all of the other coins and tokens that are evolving, you know, they think outside the box. So if someone's going to then be looking at investing in cryptocurrency, they're in the same mindset as I am. So maybe they'd be interested in my art. Mm -hmm.